you know, the Ralph Babosas of the world, uh, to turn around and go, hey, man, I want to make my the path for you easy. But nobody knows who that motherfucker yeah. is. What are you saying his name, man? I, I... What's up, everybody? It's D's World. I got a reaction. I now, I'm out to react the beef right there, you know, with... I guess it's been, it's been going a year or early this year. It uh, George Lo George Lopez and Ralph Barbosa. Um, you know the younger comedian. I like I like Ralph Ralph Barbosa. I like Ralph Barbosa. I think that he's freaking hilarious to be. All his new stuff from the last almost two years that I've been listening to him and all the all the stuff is freaking hilarious, man. Now. George Lopez to me, I used to like George Lopez as growing up. My grandma used to love his show, and I used to watch all of it. It was, I mean, I watched most of them with, you know, um, with my grandma. And shoot, yeah, it was a great show, man. But I think ever since then, he just, he, he's just kind of on some other stuff now. And and I seen him one time around 2019. It was, I, I was in Reno. Me and my ex-girlfriend. Um, we went to Reno and we found out. Oh, we got to find something to do. And we went to one of the casinos. And there was a stand-up for him. And we just we just went. We're like, might as well, you know. And i am be honest. He wasn't even funny, man. He was like half the time talking about political stuff and everything. And you know when he had... You have like Dave Chappelle when he talks about it. But he flips it and makes a funny joke with it, you know. Talking about Trump and whatever and and Joe Biden and all the stuff he does. You know, all his stand-ups is hilarious. But him, it was more like aggressive and kind of like mad at the time. You know, it wasn't even like, like damn, I, I kind of want, I did want my money back to be honest, man. Because it wasn't even funny at all, bro. But uh, let's go see what he's talking about, the little beef about it. So he's probably just hating on the younger dude, though. That's probably why, though, man. Because he's funnier than him now. And now he's just a hater to me. So, let's go. Yeah, with your George Lopez, which is hilarious, bro. But uh, I mean, I'm sure it's been beat to death, and people yeah. ask about it 900 times. But yeah, yeah. I, I saw it. I saw it. Um, yeah, it is what it is, man. Yeah. You know, the only thing I the, the only thing I say now is like, like George. I don't I don't have a problem with George Lopez himself. Um, it just does kind of suck that like I feel like I put a lot of work and effort. I'll talk about being Hispanic on stage from time to time, you know? I try not to make my whole set about it. If anything, I'll make it like maybe 5 10% of my set. I don't know. But I try to just write jokes that are unique to me and also relatable to, like, the majority of people. You know, I want I want everybody to think I'm funny, you know? Like, I'm proud to make my people proud. You know, I'm proud to be Hispanic, Mexican, Latino. But I would like for everybody to think it's funny, you know what I mean? Yeah. Be on, like, a whole other level. That's what Fluffy was saying. Yeah. So... Even as an open micer, people were always like, oh, yeah, you're going to be the next George Lopez? And I'm like, why is that the first comic? Because nah, man, he's way more. F his, his jokes is it's is way different because, you know, I'm going to I have to, like, be honest, though, like George Lopez, when he got big, big in the 2000s and everything, like early, middle 2000s, it was funny, though. You know, I remember that one is like he's trying to go to the uh, <laughs> trying to like the. um fast food and he's all like we want some beverages beverages what's that oh talk about talking about soda stupid <laughs> i remember that that was hella funny find a fountain drinks do you have <laughs> one minute please yes fountain drink it's soda why you don't say soda stupid but everything else man he's He's not even funny no more. It's just, it kind of sucks, though. It's like, what happened? He have like, a stroke or something? Ah, that's messed up to think about it. Something happened, you just, you just not funny no more, man. Because you're to. Mexican. Yeah, right? That's all they're saying, yeah. So, I'm trying my best for years to not be associated with George Lopez, with my jokes, with everything, you know? And then George Lopez goes on and says that 
and it's like fuck. Now I have no choice but to be associated. Like it's like if I'm trying so hard not to walk in dark shit, and I'm I'm staring at this dark shit so much that I accidentally stepped in this dark shit. Like somebody just threw the dark shit at me. It's like God damn it. Yeah, now I, I, for everywhere I go, even if not everybody smells it, I'll have the slightest hint of dark shit on my shoe for the rest of my career. Damn. Yo, we met. Wow. We met an hour ago. Yeah. I've used dog shit as references all the <laughs> time. So when you say I'm like, no, you just. Stepping dog shit. <laughs> I said this yesterday, two days ago. Got a shit sandwich. <laughs> I like the way this is <laughs> going. Yeah, you're always gonna smell a little bit, but it's like also it's like, are you? I think you're fine. I think you're fine. Yeah, just because we'll like goes. you know, I I saw it. I, I was just hating. It's okay. Yeah. It's okay. Sometimes people. Up. To yeah. me, it felt like the world kind of responded like, "Damn, that's some hate, Nash. What's wrong with you?" Yeah, and that was cool that people were like having my back. You know? Yeah. What I mean? When you're genuine, just you. I'm yeah, sure when you saw you, like, you jerk. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm gonna go back to do what I was doing anyway because yeah. it's like at the end of the day, I'm not gonna sit here and Cuba Gooding Jr. swing and fucking yeah, boys in the hood cool. cry. <laughs> but I also <laughs> agree. With oh, over there, uh, like, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? That thing's hella funny though. And that every time you watch that inside Boys in the Hood, yeah, Boys in yeah Boys in the Hood, that thing's freaking hilarious when he does that. I mean, I like it when they go like, Men uh, "Don't be a menace," so when he just uh, and just swing all the kids. <laughs> Shout out to that, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, let's keep going. Who is he, what he was saying on that podcast, George Lopez, I think they wanted, on that podcast, I, I believe it was, they were telling him that he should apologize to like Paul Rodriguez for, for a bunch of shit that he spoke t to him or about him. And George was like, nah, I shouldn't. If I, if I remember correctly, he was saying something like, nah, I shouldn't apologize because, I mean, we're comics on the podcast. You're shooting the shit. Like, whatever. And I agree with that, too. Like, shoot the shit, man. He apologized, which I appreciate a lot. Don't get me wrong. But I was like, man, like, you didn't have to let these people bully into apologizing. Into apologizing. Yeah. Right? Like, mm -hmm. but, you better post that black square on your Instagram. But I do, I do like he did it, like, fucking, like, privately, like. Cause I don't think he did it for people. I think he did it out of like he just, just hit you up. Then. Yeah, he hit me up. He called me. He's just like, nah, man. And I told him he didn't have to. He's like, nah, man. He's like, I want to. And I was like, I, I appreciate it. So I was like, oh, that's cool, you know. Yeah, that's cool, man. It's a good way to end it. All you oh, that's cool, Dan. Just jumping into frame. That, that man's been good. good. See, that, <laughs> see, <laughs> see, that's the one that I remember when growing up, early two thousands, middle two thousands, whatever. It shows right there. That's when he was funny, man. He was funny and. His person he worked with was funny. His mom inside that that show was hilarious. The whole class, the, everybody was, the, the cast, that thing was all funny, man. For real, shout out to that that, that uh, show again, man. That thing is underrated, to be honest. If you never really watch it, you guys are going to watch it, man. All I ever think of. The, the man has been in, in this fucking industry for years Long and years. Like, there's got to be so much that that he's had to do it or that pisses him off to get to that point you know what i mean like oh, yeah he was just hating dude it's like the meet and reach at 70 going <laughs> i'm a year into comedy <laughs> bro i'm a year into comedy yeah. and i'm still george lopez how old is george lopez let's see how old is george lopez he is uh 62 okay yeah all right still like on the beginner level and then i see like adam sandler and i'm like how the fuck is that dude still how do you so deal nice with this? that dude's so mm. nice to everybody like what the fuck? i think it's this and this is where you'll never lose it you, you you could just be the person going oh my god adam sandler or you could just be adam sandler like you know, I'll tell adam you sandler story. is still the man always though. taking a picture always saying hi always smiling because that person they don't know that you stepped in dog shit. Yeah. They just like Adam Sandler. He was a. F oh. Like, yeah. No. Also, it's like gotta be cool. We yeah. like not to be cocky, or whatever. But in this industry, we get paid pretty handsomely. Yeah. You know what I mean? If if a McDonald's cashier has a pissy attitude to me when I ask them for something extra or just to be like I don't know, like I get it. You, you make minimum wage, like this job sucks, whatever. But if I have that McDonald's pissed off customer service that sucks because i don't make mcdonald's wages mm -hmm. you know what i mean thankfully like by the grace of god yeah. like whatever it is like thankfully like so i should be more appreciative like I'm, i make what i make because of the people so i can't exactly. be like that to the people like yeah exactly. five percent of comedians make 
a earning like that. You know what I mean? Like yeah. a lot of comedians do earn that McDonald's. Yeah, shit, so like, it's like, you know, it's bro, I'm li- something I'm to be happy about. Doing exactly like, what I wanted to do. Like oh, this is my dream yeah. job. So like, fuck, I, I should kick it cool. I don't know what my attitude is gonna be like. When I'm George Lopez's age, so I, I can't. They would come here. back and talk mm-hmm. about him in 35 years. Like, <laughs> Yo, it's full PI. Yeah, he, he FaceTimed. This new guy called me. <laughs> flew over in his car and he apologized. I'm like, these new comics, bro. Yeah. <laughs> he's an AI robot. Well, how am I supposed to respect this fool? <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? In 30 years, it's gonna be scary. Robots have feelings too. Yeah, he just he was just hating right there. You know, he's getting older probably. I remember that kind of stuff. I showed a little, you know, the clip. Probably showed you right here, though. Hey, man. I, look, I think it's great, and I'm, I'm, I'm doing it. Wrong to say, I, I'm, I'm doing exactly uh, what, what I'm preaching is. What do you mean you don't can we bring this kid up? Right? Have you heard of him? Okay, but is it wrong for me to say why do you keep bringing his name up? Nobody knows who he is. <laughs> but yeah, man, I just don't know, man. He just hating though. He should be like, man, that new, that new. That new man, that that young kid, that dude's going to be good, better and better. You all understand, but now he was kind of just hating, and I just didn't understand, man. Come on, you got to, like, show love to the people, you know, because I'm basically half Mexican, so, yeah. And everybody else, we got to just support everybody, you know, every, just any kind of race and everything anyways, but, yeah, man, I agree with him, but at least they squashed the beef, though, so it's cool. And yep, they can all make money, man. <laughs> yeah. Alright, man. Well, um Hit me in the comments. Tell me what you think about this, man. Do you think he's right? George Lopez is right? Or this and this and this, man. Just hit me in the comments. Like, subscribe, show love. Alright, peace. <laughs>